in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, Canada, respectively. They are Ryan Chambers and the Canadian Superman Big D, the Bearded Dragon. <laughs> Dust. I blame him. 
He's a bad influence. Overhand wrist lock now by Bouncer, almost a double-handed wrist lock. Ryan Chambers with the full arm drag and twist out into the hammer lock. See, now I'm keeping up now that he's not distracting me. Side headlock now by Bouncer on Ryan Chambers. Semi-final action here, Arm. Yeah. We got it. This is I would, when when this was presented to the championship. We were very very happy that this match was going to go on. These, we have the former tag team champions in the Bouncer and in the Bus, who, might I add, are looking very good throughout this tournament. We have, we have the uh, really new team of uh, the Bearded Dragons, but. Uh, guys, when uh, they don't like using signs, because uh, signs, signs, every other signs, uh, that was for no. But uh, when they're not using signs, they're a pretty solid tag team. So who knows, they might be able to advance themselves. Uh, I meant to, I should have catched you off there a little bit earlier there. That was the splendid kick there by Bouncer, because it's not quite as sweet as the sugar foot. And Arm, you, you mentioned uh, earlier, Bouncer and Angel Dust, former tag team champions. I, I wonder, wonder who led them to those tag team titles. Do you was that a splendid kick by Angel Dust? Whoa, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm sure he's sitting a little bit to the left of me. Oh, that would be during the Dish Davenport. Oh, that is right. Dish. Weren't they tag champions under the moniker of the family? You're absolutely right here. I was kind of around then. Oh, I'm not as out of touch with the uh, with the history of this company as everybody likes to think. Be quiet, have something new. Okay. Okay, Bouncer, you do your thing. Oh. Wow. I big leg drop by Bouncer as I refuse to acknowledge the reference made before it. Wow. Arm. Arm. Control yourself. Dish, get him. Boom, boom, shake the room. Big no suplex there by the bouncer on Ryan Chambers. We do. I smell a conspiracy bouncer. Just a barrage unleashed on Ryan Five Chambers. minutes gone by here. She's not yeah, I actually think Jake Clemens made the right call there. I think Angel Dust is legal. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she she uh, she had her birthday this weekend. She turned six. <laughs> I am so glad you said that, and I didn't, Dish. Hashtag big number. Oh. Tag me to Big D. Angel Dust giving up a sizable weight disadvantage here. Angel Dust gives up a sizable weight and disadvantage every time she steps in the ring. So I really don't think that's anything new for her to have to fight back against. But that's a lot. Big D is, uh, as I would put it, big. Um, I like to. I don't know if you caught what Angel just said when she tagged in Bouncer there. She's like, not it. Shots. Trading right hands now. Bouncer with the advantage. Far side Irish oh. lift. Big D comes back. Ducks under the clothesline. Ducks under it again. And an extra strong clothesline by Bouncer takes Big D down. And it looks like Bouncer might have hurt that right arm a little bit. Well, quite a bit of impact it just took there. I have a five count JK. I'm not even in here. Get out of the 
Come on, Jake, you real. Jake, Angel Dust is calling you. Go talk to Angel. Ooh. What? Working hard to advance in this tag team tournament for a shot at the RAPW Tag Team Champions. Now, whichever team wins here, oh, will go on to face the Pearly Gates Ministry. No, no, no. And, oh, go ahead, Rupert. Bouncer in a bad spot over there in the corner with uh, Ryan Chambers at the big D. Ryan Chambers was working that knee. Now, with that blatant choke. <laughs> Ryan Chambers tags in his partner, Big D. Double headbutt. Big T coming in with the leg, with the knee drop now. Cover. Serious, bro. Serious. Back into the corner is Bouncer now by Big T. Hey, Dish, I gotta say, for a relatively new team here in RAPW, the Bearded Dragons are working really well against a pair of former tag team champions. Oh, you and you definitely have to give credit where it's due. These guys are looking to make an end for themselves in this tag team tournament. Last week we saw them brutally attack Adam Morris. They are looking to get noticed and move up the ranks, no doubt. And if I'm not mistaken, they actually defeated the team of uh, Eddie Insane and Black in the first round when Eddie re-injured that knee. That's right, putting Eddie, Eddie, Eddie and Sam yeah. out for right now what's an indeterminate amount of time. Uh, can you fill the fans in here that maybe might not have been here and myself? Who did Bouncer and Angel just beat in the first round? You're putting me on the spot because I don't remember it, but that sounds correct. We've had so many teams in this tournament that uh, they're getting a little jumbled up for the old man over here. <laughs> but I do believe you're right. It was Sean Resnick and Bruiser Schmidt. And, oh, oh. Pop-up lariat in the corner there by Ryan Chambers and Big D back on the attack. Yes. We've hit the 10 minute mark. Wow. Big D did the four throw, sir. That was awesome. That's actually plowed him right over. I'll tell you what, the uh, bearded dragons, they might be giants. Double headbutt there by the bearded dragons, and now Ryan. Do you think the beard gives them an advantage when it comes to throwing those headshots? Maybe a little like single leg drop kick there by Bouncer. They have their own degrees of leverage depending on which one's out there. I definitely think Big D's beard is more impressive. Hey. Shot to the back of the head there by Ryan Chambers. And now gouging the eyes. You're gouging his eyes, why do you ask? Whoa! Snap some back. Come on, Bouncer! Off Ryan the off the ropes with the knee drop, comes back down with a second, and then leaps into an elbow. An aggressive combination there. 11 minutes deep into this match, and the tag is made to Big D. Yeah! Here comes the big guy. Well, all right. 
It's not usual that we see Bouncer outweighed in an RAPW ring. I mean, it's muscle and muscle. Belly to belly there by Big D. It's not usual, as I said. How much weight do you think he's given up to Big D here? A lot. At least a buck fifty. A lot. Really? I'd say closer to 100, but it's all, it's probably close to triple digit. Irish reverse, clothesline duck, clothesline duck to Ken. Double clothesline, everybody down in the ring, shaking with the impact. It almost shattered. But we still have three matches tonight. That's almost like when they shatter a backboard in basketball. You just have to wait. <laughs> We'd have to go to intermission. I think so. More hot dogs. Dish, can we call intermission if the ring breaks? Do I have to eat hot dogs? More hot dogs. Yeah, intermission. We are there. Hey! <laughs> intermission time. Tags made on both sides. Angel Dust and Ryan Chambers in. Caught on the attempted oh, 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 clothesline. Oh, oh, oh. But Angel Dust throwing club yeah. elbows. Back kick. Gammon gear, theory. I have the hiccups, excuse me. I think this is why uh, Ryan Chambers didn't want to deal with Angel Dust. But look at this. Oh my goodness. He threw his own partner out of the ring, but needs to pay attention to what's behind him. Yeah. 